This weekend commemorates the 50th anniversary of the March on Selma. And to kick things off is the mayor's reception. I am Jasmine Morgan reporting here at the Convention Center in Selma, Alabama. Event goers listened to live music, enjoyed delicious dinner, and heard from their city council members, as well as freedom fighters who marched on the bridge that day. For one freedom fighter, crossing the Edmund Pettus Bridge that day will always be a memory she will never forget. To me, it was a sunny day, and it just was just amazing to just be there to walk with Dr. King. I mean, it just was, it was really, it was thousands of people from all over. If you are in the house, please come. <laughs> if you would like to stand in, for a parent or a sister who's no longer with us, I'm going to go ahead and stand, tell you that I'm standing here for my mom who passed away some months ago, uh, who was there in 1965. The mayor even took some time from his reception to share his optimism for the historic city. Yeah, it's just been a lot going on, uh, talking to a lot of people, moving around, trying to get everything in place with the help of others, and uh, just pumped up about what the future owes and has for our city. I, I'm, yeah, I, I feel good about it and uh, can't hardly sleep at night sometimes, just getting all restless trying to be prepared and be ready for what's about to happen here. Reporting from the Selma Convention Center, I am Jasmine Morgan with Howard University News Service.